Hello and welcome to this video on Sitecore Xperia's Commerce 9.3. Here we're going to be looking at some of the improvements that have been made to the Commerce Business Tools. The Commerce Business Tools are an Angular application and with the release of 9.3 we've updated over 40 different dependency versions. We've also removed a series of components that are no longer required. And all of that combined has resulted in a close to 60% reduction in the page size. We've also introduced some search improvements. These include new indexes to make it faster and easier for you to find your promotions and your price cards. We've also introduced switch on rebuild functionality. Now this has existed for a long time in XP, but is now available to you natively in Experience Commerce as well. So let's take a look at some of this in action. So I've loaded up the Commerce Business Tools, and the first thing I want to show you is the two new search indexes that have been provided. First of all, I'm going to go into my pricing section, and I'm going to search for a price card. I know I have a price card for this product ID here. We can now search for it and straight away navigate into that price card. If you can imagine a system where there's lots and lots of price cards there, this gives you much faster access to the data you need. And the same is true for the promotions. I can load up the promotion section and I know I have a promotion in here for shipping. I can search for that term and straight away get access to the promotion that I want to see. The final piece I wanted to show you was the switch on rebuild functionality. I've loaded up the search policy set into Visual Studio Code. I'm going to scroll down a little bit. And here you can see an instance of a search scope policy. This is the search scope policy for the catalog items index. And you can see here we have all of the properties to provide a switch on rebuild functionality. We have the name of the primary and secondary index and also whether the switch on rebuilds enabled or not. And all this functionality is available for you for your custom indexes as well. If you have a custom index and you want to enable the switch on rebuild functionality, all you need to do is provide one of these search scope policies and the rest of it will be handled for you. Thanks for watching and don't forget to follow the Learn Sitecore hashtag for future videos.